everybody. Uh, my name is Victoria. Welcome to La Vida Victoria. This is my very first YouTube, so we'll see how this goes. Bear with me. Uh, it's not going to be as fancy as some other people's videos, but I was inspired to make this video because I, um, I'm in my third trimester in 32 weeks and six days. Um, so I was looking for maternity clothes, maternity hauls, and I really didn't see a lot that were on Shein or Shine, I'm not quite sure how you pronounce it. Um, and I was so pleased with what I received, um, so I have to share it. <laughs> you guys have to know that um, for maternity clothes, they are a great option, uh, especially because you're not going to wear maternity clothes that much in the grand scheme of life, you don't need them to be of the highest quality. Um, you know, I kind of equate it to like Forever 21 style clothes. Uh, that's um, That seems to be about the quality, which I thought it was gonna be way worse. Um, I know they come from China, so the shipping time actually took a little, I ordered it on the 1st, May 1st, and I received it on May 12th. So considering it came from China, that's really quick. But when you have Amazon and other things where you get like next day delivery, uh, it seems like I waited forever. But worth the wait because these clothes are really cheap and they always have promo codes. I used a 10, 15, or 20% off. I don't remember which one. Uh, I'll try to link all the things that I show and uh, post, you know, the prices. Um, sorry if I'm out of breath. I'm in my third trimester and uh, everything's a chore these days, as you mamas know. So, uh, let's see here. Oh, everything came shipped, nothing fancy, not in a little plastic bag. And then everything was individually wrapped in these little Ziploc bags, which, you know, nothing fancy about it, but you can reuse these. So as mamas, like in a diaper bag, if you want to, if you go swimming and you, you know, change your kid's clothes, you need like a wet bag to put it in so it doesn't get everything all nasty. You can use this. Also emergency, like diaper storage and throw it away. Like they're not going to last forever, but, um, you can use them for plenty of things. So yeah, I think I'll start shoving them in my diaper bag, using them for who knows what. Uh, so that's how it comes. All right, so this is the first one. It's called Maternity Dipsy Floral Print Knot Front Cami Dress. Originally $13.99, I got it for $11.98. And uh, I got it in the size medium. And it has a tie front, so it kind of fits perfectly you can um, so this is uh i love this dress um it has little roses on it and it has a tie front um, which makes it fit just right because you cinch it to your body uh it's actually pretty soft considering it was you know just about ten dollars <laughs> and uh really flowy it fits my big bum um, i think it's super flattering and it's lightweight and uh I live in Florida, the Panhandle, it's really hot here. This is one of the reasons why I had to go shopping for maternity clothes because I have a lot of sweaters and stuff like that, but I don't want to wear a lot of things on my waist right now. And uh, even postpartum, I think I'll be able to wear this. And if I happen to get another C-section, which I'm hoping to get a V-back this time, um, I'm not gonna want anything on there anyways. So light flowing dresses are so good. Um, especially towards the end of pregnancy. So, love this one. I think I'll get a lot of wear out of it. Okay, next we have the Maternity Dipsy Floral Print Cami Dress in red and white. Um, same thing, it's in a medium. I had to show this one next because it's so similar to the other one, but I think the other one is just slightly nicer. This is by no means as soft, but it's also not scratchy. It does feel a little lower end, um, but it's the same flow factor. Uh, I forgot to mention they both have adjustable straps, so 
that's nice. I just like the tying, uh, that tie front. It made everything feel a little more snug up top um, and more custom fit. Uh, but this is so similar and also I'll get a ton of use out of it. Um, so flowy, so nice. Uh, but I would say if you choose between the two, I would choose the one in multicolor, which is the pink roses um, with the tie front. But yeah. And then this one, it does kind of billow out just a little bit right here, um, but it doesn't bother me too much. Um, it's kind of impossible to get that perfect, perfect fit. Um, and of course, you don't have to wear bras with these either, so very, very nice. I forgot to like the price on this one. This one was eleven forty nine, so it was cheaper than the other one, and uh, but I got it on sale for nine eighty four, so under ten dollars. Steal of a deal. Love it. Okay, next we're getting wild with some animal print. This one is called the Maternity Off Shoulder Ruffle Hem All Over Print Dress. Um, everything I got was in a medium, so you know. Oh, and let me tell you the price. It was originally $16.49, got it for $14.11. Um, I think it looks so much better than it actually does in the picture. Um, so flattering on the bump, don't have to wear a bra, off the shoulder, ruffle details on the sleeves and the bottom. And then it has a tie, uh, which cinches it in right to your, um, your empire waist, I guess you call it. It's, this would be my true waist. Um, yeah, and it's totally not see-through or anything. Once again, it's a really light fabric, perfect for hot summer humid days, um, like where I'm at. Uh, but I love kitty cats. I have a cat. So I do like leopard prints and things, and I think it's more of a tasteful leopard print. It's not, you know, the old tacky... Um, those crazy prints you see. So yeah, I think I actually might wear it on Mother's Day. Uh, we'll see. I probably should have worn the first dress on Mother's Day, but I was so excited I got everything in the mail yesterday. And uh, that was kind of my favorite one, so I've been wearing it today. Day early, oh well. Um, so yeah, here's this one. Okay, next we have a little two-piece number, Mama. Um, on the shirt and little floral skirt. Uh, this is called Maternity Letter Graphic Crop Top and Ditsy Floral Print Bod. And then it cuts it off. Originally $12.99, got it for $11.13. Um, size medium again. Uh, the top is super soft. Needs to be ironed or washed or whatever, but um, you get the idea. The only thing is I cannot lift my arms above my head without showing my bra. So maybe I should wear a sports bra or something with this one. But I do like that after pregnancy and everything, when I'm back in shape, I can wear this crop top with, you know, um, some other sort of high-waisted pants and it'll be super cute. And so I'll get more wear out of this one. The skirt is uh, a little short, although it is accurate to the photo. I didn't really pay attention to the photo how short it is. And I'm no spring chicken. I'm what you call a summer chicken. I am 40 this year. So I don't want to be walking around like I'm 20 years old. And I feel like this is a little young for me, uh, but still super cute and I can rock it, whatever. Um, this skirt actually, it has an adjustable uh, band, but I'm, I guess I'm really big already. I'm, I carry big babies. Um, but it has this little thing in it, and then a button, and then there's different holes that you can pull it tighter. So if you were in, you know, your early stages of maternity, um, it would still fit you. You could keep it nice and tight, but this is... This is plenty tight for me, and there's no more room, actually. It's like at the, it's starting to go back in the hole. Um, but yeah, super cute. Uh, 
it off. And then, uh, yeah, I like it. I just I wish I could raise my arms without showing my bra. So um, I'll have to wear something that I don't mind people seeing. That's all. But yeah, cute and something different. Two piece, two piece number. Okay, next we have the Maternity Striped Deep V-neck Backless Shirt Halter Dress. Originally $16.49, got it for $14.11. Steal of a deal. Um, so this is a cute little nautical stripe, great for the beach or boat days. Um, the only thing difficult about it is it has three separate ties. Um, so the neckline has two each on each side, and if you try to do it at the same time, like everything, it doesn't, you get a better fit doing it one at a time. Otherwise, um, one's gonna be out a little bit. Uh, then the other one, the third one ties around the back. So you do get a good fit, nice snug fit, and there's plenty of room for belly in here, for third trimester belly. It is a deep V, um, so there is that. Not as conservative, um, but it has nice ruffle detail on the bottom, and it's that. It's not the soft, but not scratchy fabric. Um, very light. I feel like this would be great for a pool area as well. The nice big floppy hat. Um, very flowy, lightweight, great for summer. Okay, this is the last of all the dresses. Uh, this is the Maternity Rib Knit Halter Top and Pencil Skirt Set in Dusty Blue. Uh, in person, this is actually a lot more blue than the picture. The picture has kind of a blue-green to it. Um, but it's really comfy. It's easy to walk in. There's a big slit up the back, which makes it easy to walk. But it's very stretchy, so you don't feel restricted like some pencil skirts you can't really walk around in. Uh, you do have to be very mindful of your undergarments, otherwise you might get some lines showing. So it was really hard to find the right bra, uh, but I did find one that works, so hooray. Um, it is very thin and that is why you absolutely need a bra with this one. You can also see my belly button poking out, but uh, you can see my belly button in a lot of my clothes, so, you know, can't really do much about that. Hopefully it goes back one day. Um, but yeah, it's very comfortable, and like I, I do like this color a lot. And it's comfy and feels very stylish, and I like that it's two-piece, but it's not super cropped. It's just like a peekaboo of skin. Um, and yeah, I feel very feminine and girly in all these clothes, which is what I wanted. They're all colorful and fun, and I feel like we as society have been stuck in the minimalist, like everything must be black, white, or gray, and uh, wanted to have a little more fun with my clothes. So, I am now, forgot to mention, the price. So this was originally, oh, this was on sale. This was originally $11.99. I got it for $7.19. So, you know, it's okay that it's a little thin, you know. Just have to find the right stuff to wear under it and you'll be all good. All right. Okay, and here is the swimsuit. It is a three-pack plant print twist bikini swimsuit and kimono. Combo. Originally $16.20, I got it for $13.82. Steal of a deal. I love this. I feel quite glamorous in it and tropical. Um, all things that I love. But even after uh, pregnancy, I'll be able to still wear the top. There's adjustable straps, um, so that's nice. And then, of course, the cardigan or the wrap you can wear as well. Just not the bottoms, but I can easily pair it with a pair of black bottoms I already have. Um, yeah, so I think it fits really well, nice and snug. Although, if I get, well, my belly will keep growing. I'm almost 33 weeks, um, but I still have some time to go, so 
I think this will just go a little bit lower and lower and you'll probably see my belly button a lot easier, which I'm not crazy about. I could keep yanking it up, but uh, that's a little uncomfortable just for a look. So um, it is what it is. Uh, but I am quite pleased. I didn't think I'd find a uh, maternity swimsuit so easily that I liked that was so cheap. Um, so I highly recommend this, um, especially since you'll get more wear out of it in just a few months when you're pregnant. So yeah, can't wait to go to the pool and lay out outside. <laughs> okay, last item. We made it to the end of the haul. I love this robe. It is called the Maternity Letter Embroidery Contrast Binding Belted Robe. It's in baby pink, size medium. Uh, originally $13.49, got it for $11.56. Incredible deal. It's actually soft. Um, it has some white embroidery right here, which there is a thread coming out, so that's not good. Um, but I'll just snip that. Um, it says Mama. Uh, you had a choice of a pink one or I think a blue one, and although I am having another baby boy, um, I don't have to wear blue just because I'm having a boy. I like pink, so I am wearing this, so I chose pink, and uh, I actually love this sleeve length. I've never had a robe with like three-quarter sleeves, and uh, when you wash dishes and stuff, like normally I'm pushing up my sleeves and they fall down. Keep pushing them up and then so inevitably they get wet. Um, so I like that I don't have to worry about that with these because I'm always wearing a robe in the morning um, for coffee and breakfast and then I clean the kitchen after that. Um, but yeah, it's actually surprisingly so soft. It's the nicest fabric of anything purchased. To, um, and this will definitely be going with me in my hospital bag. I will wear this in the hospital after I have the little one. So um, just so you know, you probably, uh, I haven't really fully introduced myself, but I have a almost two year old son named Dean. And then I will be having another baby boy um, due July 1st. So they'll be basically two years and maybe two weeks or so apart. It's basically two years apart. I'm hoping they'll be best friends. They'll be super cute. Um, so yeah, that's my maternity haul. Thanks for watching. Uh, like I said, I had to share this content because everything that I saw for maternity wasn't really spring dresses or super girly vibes. Everything's more lounge and comfort. And I think that I've been feeling extra frumpy. So for some reason right now, I just... I feel like glamming it up a notch. Um, I used to do that uh, for a living. I was a dance major in college, and then I went on to do a bunch of shows, and I played dress up for a living. You know, we um, got ready, put on our glam makeup and our lashes, and did our hair, or wore wigs, and it was super fun. And I kind of missed that part. That was like, that was joyful for me. So I've been trying to make it part of my daily doings and it's really true for some women like myself not everybody um but i feel better when i look better and uh yeah and just dresses are so easy uh it's a complete outfit in one people think you put all this effort into it uh because you look nice but actually i find that coordinating a shirt with shorts and then your belt and then your accessories it just seems like that's always harder for me to put together and it's more challenging. So dresses are just easier. Uh, yeah. So I will be ordering from Xi'an Chine. Please let me know how to pronounce that the correct way. Um, I will be ordering from them again. And I'm also really interested in their baby stuff because babies, once again, don't wear things for very long. So you don't need the highest quality. And now that I know that it's not like complete garbage, like. It doesn't smell like chemicals, which I was afraid maybe, maybe it's so cheap it might, you know, but it doesn't. Um, so I'd really like to try out some of their baby stuff because uh, they have some really cute things. Uh, yeah. So until next time, 
Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Mwah.